Born from 1,000 years of metalwork history, Sakai City, Osaka, Japan became a capital of bicycle production at the beginning of the 20th century. In 1921, Mr. Shozaburo Shimano began with an affordable, high-quality, single-speed freewheel. For 89 years, Shimano has been driven to manufacture bicycle components that increase enjoyment for the rider. Since its release in 1991, XTR has always been the benchmark of this effort in the mountain bike world. When I first started riding XTR, it was, it was early in my mountain bike career. Very reliable, all the things that you want as a racer, you know, all the things that you want as a rider, obviously, but perhaps racing, it's just a little bit amplified like and you need that reliability you need that kind of um, confidence in your equipment all the time so um, XTR just really sort of laid that out for us and I never worried about my bike breaking down it was all just about whether my legs broke down when we started racing it wasn't about multiple or different bikes for different disciplines you know it was about that one bike that you could do everything on um, so the bike that I, you know, raced cross country on was the bike that I raced downhill on and XTR was the group that was on my bike for everything. I've been to Japan a bunch of times. I started coming here in 1990. I didn't really realize what I was in for, but that was sort of my first experience with XTR was actually working on that first M900 group. You know, XTR since the beginning has been in a constant evolution. The history of XTR and where it started and where it is now shows the, the versatility.